name is Jennifer Sowers and thank you for visiting our website today. These instructional videos are designed to be an education tool. Please speak with your supplier and your physician for exact uses of the product that you choose. A physician must write a prescription for durable medical equipment and supplies. The prescription needs a diagnosis and length of need in order to be considered for coverage by Medicare and or insurance policies. Certain insurance policies may pay for your equipment, but payment is based on diagnosis and other information, so be sure to check with your carrier in advance. In addition to a prescription, Medicare requires that your DME equipment is to be used in your home. Medicare only covers items that are considered medically necessary, and some items could be convenience items and therefore will not be covered. Thanks so much. I hope you enjoy these videos. I'm here today to educate you on the needs and uses of bathroom safety products. These instructional videos are designed to be an education tool. Please speak with your supplier and physician for exact uses of the product you choose. Any item that is used in the bathroom is not typically reimbursable through Medicare and or insurance carriers. However, since the commode can be used next to the bed, it can be covered by insurance carrier if you qualify. The 3-in-1 commode has three main purposes, as its name suggests. It can be used by the bed for a patient who cannot ambulate to the standard bathroom facility. It consists of a lid, seat, back, and arm support, and underneath has a bucket and a splash guard. The legs are adjustable based on the height of the patient. After use, the bucket can be removed and emptied into the toilet. A second purpose for this item is being used right above the existing toilet. The back bar and bucket can easily be removed, and in its place, please put the splash guard and place directly over the toilet. The arms allow for the patient to sit down and stand up easily. Be sure to adjust the height of the commode first. The third feature of this item is it can be used as a shower chair. It's powder coated to prevent rust, and the rest is plastic. It will not fit into a tub since it is too wide, but can easily fit into the shower. Place the back bar to provide additional support. The bucket can be removed and simply allow the patient to sit, or the bucket can stay if the customer wants to use it as a toilet in the shower. To clean, simply use soap and water. An option available is a drop arm commode for a person who cannot ambulate and needs to side transfer from either a wheelchair or a bed onto the commode. It can also be put over the toilet since the backrest comes up and it's height adjustable. Another commode available is a bariatric commode. This is a higher weight capacity of up to 600 pounds and a wider distance between the arm rails. It's a very sturdy commode and has all the same features available like the drop arm feature. Another product designed to be used in the bathroom exclusively as a private pay item is not covered through Medicare is a shower or bath chair which is made of aluminum and heavy duty blow molded plastic to prevent the rust. It's height adjustable and it can hold up to 250 pounds with a standard model. Some shower chairs are narrow enough to fit into a standard tub or shower. It has handles on the back and the seat and it's available with or without a back. The tub transfer bench is designed for a patient who has difficulty getting into the tub. It has a grab bar on one end and two legs with suction cups to go into the tub and prevent slipping. The other two feet should stay outside of the tub on the floor and is made of rubber. A patient who has difficulty lifting their legs over the tub can sit down and slide over onto the tub utilizing the handrail to pull themselves over. Most patients always have a shower head that can be removed instead of one that's bolted into the mall. Also available is toilet safety rails which will install on most toilets. There should be plastic wing nuts located just under where the seat and back attach to the toilet. You simply unscrew them, put the rails over the toilet, replace the seat back down, and attach to an existing toilet to fasten arm rails. The legs are adjustable to change the height, and it's made of aluminum and plastic and can be cleaned with the same supplies you do as your toilet.